Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So recently I got a little obsessed with the Louis Vuitton small leather kits and I can't even remember why. <laughs> I think somehow I blamed it on the lockdown where you put majority of your time scrolling the internet, watching videos, and just seeing a lot of good stuff in Instagram. But yeah, okay, I can't find any more reasons to put as an excuse. <laughs> but I am having that urge of buying this stuff. And I know it is not the right timing considering the pandemic. It is really better to save up. And I'm not encouraging my viewers to splurge during this time. But what I can say is that it is definitely okay to reward yourself from time to time. Personally, I would always recommend to save up, but there's also nothing wrong to spend on something you really want that will make you happy in such a way, as long as you have some extra money to shell out and you will not be in debt, if you know what I mean. So anyways, um, going back to the purpose of this video, you would already see from the title that I will be comparing my coach wallet Although, in particular, it is called the Coach Snap Card Case in Signature Canvas versus my recent purchase in Louis, Louis Vuitton, which is the Rosalie Coin Purse, which I think is also considered as a small wallet, which mine is in the classic monogram um, coated canvas in rose ballerine color. So let's start with my coach um, wallet. So as you can see, um, the exterior of this coach um, wallet is in mahogany color. Um, in coach canvas with tulip print. So if I'll show you. This is how it looks like. Um, I can no longer see this available um, because Coach is changing designs every now and then. You can see, um, you can still see this snap card case from other resellers, maybe, or even in the Coach outlets, but this particular print with Chulip will no longer be um, available now. So talking about the size, this one is 11.43 um, centimeters in length and about 9.53 centimeters in height. And the width will be around 1.5, oh, sorry. Yeah, um, the width would be 2.5 centimeters down to 2 centimeters. Yeah, that one. So, just a quick story about this. I got this back in November of 2019. And since then, I've been using it daily prior to the lockdown back in March. So if we will count, that's probably around four months of use. I am bringing this with me whenever I go to coffee shops or restaurants when I'm going out for lunch. And I'm completely careless about this wallet. So as you can see, it is, um, it is, it comes in a silver hardware, but looking at um, this flower hardware over here, it's a two-toned um, color on its zipper pull, which I will describe more later. It's super thin and um, at the same time, I don't have anything inside. Well, I just have one um, card here. So currently I'm not using this since I had a new purchase, as I mentioned. A while ago and I want this baby to hibernate for a while to lessen the stress on the canvas because it was a little abused for a few months. <laughs> so
so yeah as you can see when i open the wallet you will um see that there is an id window here there's also one two three three um card credit card slots and additional two slots over here Um, that can be used if you have like extra IDs, receipts, or if you're carrying more cards with you. The material is soft leather, so it's not hard to insert cards. So just a sample. There. Perfect. <laughs> So, it also has a full-length um, bill compartment here. It has a snap closure. And a pretty decent zippered compartment for your coins or loose change. Right here. And it's very smooth. The zipper um, has a, a flower hardware which comes in two tones, silver and gold as what I've um, mentioned a while ago as well and it, it makes it more unique and cute. I have plenty of wallets from my MK Coach and Kate Spade collections but so far this has been the most convenient wallet for my lifestyle Hence, I am surely keeping this one. So, actually, can it see a downside on this wallet? Because it can fit in all of my bags. Just take note that since it is still considered as a small wallet, in terms of size, then it is not recommended if you will be bringing more stuff with you or more coins with you. Because obviously, there will be no um, enough rooms for that. Okay, so moving on to the next one, which is the Rosalie um, coin purse from Louis Vuitton, which I love calling a wallet instead of a coin purse. And mine comes in the monogram print, but I know that this also comes in, in different variations and colors. I chose the rose ballerine specifically because I'm in love with pink color. Let me show you there pretty nice right it has a gold hardware a green cowhide leather trim and green cowhide leather lining with one zipped um coin pocket and let's try the zipper it's also smooth but i have um one card inside so The inside has a gusseted or a triangular shape um, compartment, as you can see, um, where I usually put my bills or cards. It has two card slots over here and down here. Um, and one extra slot where I put my driver's license here. And it's funny that it's called a coin purse, but I never use this for my coins. I'm using my key pouch to keep my coins instead. Um, because the Rosalie wallet has a flat pocket, as you can see. Um, I would like to put some cards or IDs inside instead of coins, but it is really cute and thin as well which is perfect size that goes pretty well even in my smallest bags. So for the measurement, it has 11 um, centimeters in height, uh, sorry, in length, 8 centimeters in height, and 2.5 centimeters, which goes down to 1.5 centimeters in width. So comparing it to 
with a coach wallet here. Okay, let me just show it to you. It's a little smaller and thinner. There. And although the coach wallet can be more versatile because um, this Rosalie one has just a limited compartment inside, it has a press um, stud closure and there are a lot of complaints with this small button, um, which is a colored letter by the way. That can the um i think it doesn't hold up much longer and may chip off easily so unlike the coach wallet where i can be very careless i think for this um rosalie one um i would need to take extra caution or extra care when i'm using to preserve the color of the button but they're actually um both very cute and worth it however for the most important part we need to make a comparison with the price point as well so like what i said sometimes what makes you happy matters a lot in making a decision of what you may want to purchase but for the major part and sorry about that <laughs> um sorry about that noise it is also best to consider what's more convenient for your lifestyle in terms of practicality and of course your budget. So just one more look to compare both wallets. The Rosalie wallet from LV. I bought this from reseller resellers at a whopping 475 USD or 23,000 pesos, while the coach wallet I bought from a reseller for only 54 USD or 2,600 in Philippine pesos. Both of them looks really nice, compact, easy to use, sturdy, and gorgeously made. Um, but I will leave it up for you guys to decide what your preference are and what you think is the best one for you. But please feel free to share your thoughts by leaving a comment on this video. I would really love to know what you think and will try to respond if you have questions for me. If you like this video, please like and subscribe and would love to see you on my next one. Thank you!